70, update on opening of school information, Mr. Vaughn. Good evening, uh, again, Chairman Wright and school board members. As a leadership team, we wanted to provide you with an update on the reopening of our schools. Uh, as a group, we were in all the schools on the multiple first days of school. Uh, it's difficult for us to describe the excitement that we observe from both students and our staff. The idea of returning to some sort of normalcy, albeit in a hybrid format, has been a refreshing and rewarding experience for everyone. Many, many, many individuals have spent tireless hours in preparing for this opening, and the result of that planning has been evident over the first couple of weeks. Um, our students and our families have been very helpful and flexible during this new look start to school. Our 350 or so staff members are as professional and as talented as any. Yes, this has been extremely stressful. Yes, we're learning to build this school year as we move along. And yes, this is an ever-changing playing field. Nonetheless, we're proud to be part of the Allegheny County School of Community and all that has been accomplished over the past several months. The Virginia School Boards Association, or VSBA, sends out daily educational news stories from uh, throughout Virginia. One of the constant topics that you will read are news stories related to significant technology failures many divisions around the state have experienced. As you know, the technology piece of opening schools with a virtual component is critical for the su success and equitable opportunity for all of our students. Allegheny County Public Schools is blessed with a technology staff who in conjunction with many have thoughtfully prepared for this critical portion of reopening schools. As a result, our schools and our staff have experienced a general and issue-free delivery of this technology. We are continuing to closely monitor the education and the health status of our division. We participate in weekly calls with the Virginia Department of Health, who is providing us with the latest local and regional COVID-19 information. Uh, for other information, as of today, we had an enrollment of 1859, 1859. As you recall, we budget, uh, we were budgeted based on 1861, or 1861, so two off. Uh, as we are continuing to monitor this enrollment, we are discussing and planning how we can increase our face-to-face -face instruction, particularly with our JK through second grade students. We are all very proud of our opening and are excited to slowly and safely expand this reopening in the future. And our leadership team is here and available to answer qu any questions you might have. So what do we need to do to make sure that our JKs for a second into the schools? And I think Mr. Callahan probably could speak to that. A lot. A lot. Yeah. Uh, we have several classes that are not going to be able to pull it off in the regular routine. Uh, we would have to look at, at additional spaces throughout the school, which there's, we'll be doing over the next week or so. Uh, also, you're going to look at possibly other staff being the, the teacher of, of that subject matter rather than the teacher of record. Mm -hmm. uh, and that is, you know, that's always been a little bit of a concern for us. We do have qualified staff throughout all the schools. But we need to make sure that we're getting the best education to the kids we can uh, with the most qualified people. Mm -hmm. uh, they're in the middle of the planning process now. We're going to start hashing out some things when we meet as an administrative team mm -hmm. tomorrow too. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know if and when it will happen, but I mean that is our that is our goal and our focus. Yeah. We just definitely don't want to pull the plug before we know we're ready for it. Yeah. Because we like like we had talked about, we don't want to backtrack. No. Sounds good. Thank you. Other questions? Uh, Mr. Ron, I would just like to make one comment. I certainly do appreciate all of your updates and your email that you've been sending us. Uh, on what's going on in the leadership. Sure. Thank you. Thank you.